My name is Michael Voigt, and I play Jimmy Cambiotti in Around Every Corner. Jimmy's like the father figure of, of, the, of the bunch. Um, he's viewed as this high, overbearing, and overprotective personality. Um, and he inherits the, 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 these, these personality traits at, at a young age because um, he really didn't have have a choice. These were his responsibilities and as an older brother to, to provide for and help his family out and his younger brothers and his younger sisters. So, because his family owned the restaurant and they were always working. Jimmy had to step up to the plate and do what uh, needed to be done. Well, there's a lot of love throughout the family. I mean, it's, it, it's a very, very functional family. Um, Jimmy, Jimmy, he didn't, he didn't have a childhood like Michael and Kara and, and John. Um, he had more boundaries. They, like, like John had less boundaries than he had. He was a little more wild child, and Jimmy just had to make sure he had to take care of everybody. And uh, um, he followed in his father's footsteps uh, as, as as a chef. And he had to take over the business, and he learned at a very young age. Uh, he had to, to do chores and, and, and um, whatever he had to do to um, make amends for his family and provide and help his family out you know, as, as the older sibling. But John, on the other hand, he was, he was... What the f*** is this? I think he had, he, he had, there's a little tension there because over the years, John was, he had a little more freedom than Jimmy. He was allowed to do what he wanted. He was the creative one of the group. And so I think there's a, lot, a, lot, a little jealousy in, in seeing as they grow older between them two, and that's why sometimes those two uh, type personalities, those alpha males, they, they collide. John, stop, John, stop. We see this as Jimmy, uh, as John, um, a drug addiction becomes, um, gets worse. But for me as an actor to, to go through these, um, these big monologues, that, I mean, which is like an actor's dream, Joe Wallace gave me this material that was just like, you know, it was like a, a gold mine for, for every actor. But for me to, to uh, uh, complete my, complete that task that he gave me was, I had to go to a very, very, very dark place. People could relate to the movie because it, it deals with everyday situations that what people go through. Um, Um, like myself, I, um, my best friend, he, um, he died a, a few years ago. He was addicted to uh, heroin, and um, he, um, he committed suicide. So, to me, making a movie like this, reaching out to people, and give them the chance to... Uh, <laughs> giving them a chance to um, to survive is it's more than anything because because my my friend never had <laughs> my friend never had the chance to um, have that and to, to do something like this is very special and very very special to me. My whole life I took care of them. When mom and dad were slaving away at the restaurant, I was the one that had to bring them to the bus stop. Bring them to practice. Make sure they got their homework done. Me, not you! I love them more than anything in this entire world, man. You still go. I remember this one scene when I was in the kitchen, I was cooking, 
I mean, God forbid, I don't know how to cook. Um, <laughs> Jimmy and Mike come in, and, and I have to say this, it, this, this name, this expensive name, this wine, I have no clue. And it was called Sasakaya, so I'm screwing up. Sasakawa! I was like, Sasakawa! Hey, I need a bottle of Sasakaya! Sasakaya! How was that? <laughs> um, I, I, I kept saying it and screaming it, but I... Uh, <laughs> We had to keep redoing it and redoing the scene over and over again. I still need that wine now! To us, that was like a little something that we shared together as an inside joke when we go out. We screen the name of Sasakai. So, it's, you know, it's fun. My name is Michael Foy, and I play Jimmy Cambiani in the Round Living Corner.